Hello, and welcome to this oxygen presentation. My name is Mike Hess, and I'm a respiratory therapist with the COPD Foundation. We're joined today by Dr. Jerry Krishnan, a physician scientist from the University of Illinois, Chicago, and one of our leading experts in the treatment of chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, COPD, and other complex lung issues. Dr. Krishnan, thank you for joining us today. Thank you very much for inviting me. All right, so we're just going to jump right into some of these questions here. So uh, what would you say are some of the overall goals of oxygen therapy for somebody who might be new to uh, uh, the, the treatment? Absolutely. So oxygen, first of all, is a vital, um, uh, it's vital to life. Um, oxygen is used by uh, your entire body to function properly. Um, oxygen is used to make energy to allow your organs to function properly. So the ability to think, your ability of your heart uh, as a heart muscle to pump blood around, uh, the ability of kidneys to work properly, all of this is, uh, requires oxygen. And your lungs are really the, the center of all of this. The lungs help bring in oxygen uh, from the air that you breathe into the bloodstream. And then your heart helps pump that oxygen around to feed essentially the vital parts of your body. Most people um, may not realize that the, really the purpose of giving oxygen therapy is, is really to help your organs function normally in order to, to maintain life. Um, the oxygen that we're providing individuals is not so much directed at helping you breathe better or to relieve shortness of breath, although that is one of the things that oxygen helps to do. And the reason I'm bringing this up is that as you think about whether or not to use oxygen, it's really making a decision about whether you want your body to function normally. Um, if you do have shortness of breath or other uh, problems you're having, you should talk to your doctor about how much of that is going to be relieved by oxygen and what else should I be doing in order to relieve symptoms you may be having, such as cough or shortness of breath or inability to walk upstairs. All of those things may or may not be solved by giving uh, oxygen. 